Hey guys, Silence Yao here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross Gacha video. Before we begin, let me explain to you guys what happened to the last Gacha and why there was no video. Well, basically, I've been busy. I've been clearing up my grandmother's place because she has passed on and we have to settle some of her belongings. So therefore, um, I've been busy packing up my grandma's place. At the same time, um, we also sent off my grandparents, my grandpa and my grandma because it was my grandmother's final wish to be scattered out into the ocean. So therefore, the entire gacha for Freya was kind of left out on my YouTube channel. But you could see my pool for Freya on my Facebook group. A Facebook page actually um, for my YouTube channel links in the description down below if you want to check out what I actually got for Freya's gacha alright so today is all about Ranka we are finally finished with Valkyrie and all the swimsuits now we are going to Macross Frontier territory um, it seems like this one particular event alone will cover both of the divas Ranka being the first and followed by Cheryl in the second half and of course, after that, um, from the looks of it, I think the Red Boss event might be an SDF Macross or Macross 7 one, or maybe both. Uh, it might be a collaboration between Macross 7 and uh, SDF Macross because Milane, Basara, and Minmei are the only ones left without the swimsuit um, lineup. <clears throat> and of course, there's only one more event for the month of August. So yeah, as you can see the banner here, it shows Cheryl in her swimsuit already. Immediately you can tell straight away Cheryl is confirmed for the second half of this current event. So Cheryl Gnome fans, please stand by your singing stones and get yourself ready to obtain that swimsuit can, that can only be obtained through Gacha. Sadly for Cheryl, um, well Dana wants your money so that's pretty much how they are going to do it. <laughs> anyway guys, uh, let's dive into the Gacha for Rankas swimsuit and let's see whether her episode play is as good as those from Valkyrie itself and of course as promised by Dana the first template pool from a brand new gacha is always at 300 singing stones now all right so let's take a look and see uh, well is Macross Frontier going to be as good as Macross Delta so 3599 total score Wow, that is a real lack in total score as compared to Valkyrie. Valkyrie, even with the plus 25 luck stat, it was at a total score of around 3,800 or so. So that is a very drastic drop uh, as compared to, um, you know, Macross Delta. I'm not sure why this is so, but let's take a look at the skills of the episode plate and see whether the episode plates are actually worth your money. But of course, for Ranka fans, definitely you want to try and pull to get as many costume points as possible to unlock Ranka swimsuit as quickly as you can because you just love her to bits. Alright, so for center skill, units total is boosted by 20% up. And yeah, so not a very good center skill, so immediately you can tell straight away Ranka's plate is not meant to be used as a center position episode plate, but a live skill support plate. Alright, so active skill, life recovery of 50%. Oh, so it has a pretty decent active skill. Uh, if you need an, a yellow episode plate that has the healing capabilities, Ranka's plate is definitely uh, one of the options. Um, but because of the um, lower quality center skill, um, definitely might want to consider other plates instead of hers. Alright, life skill, score and damage. So immediately with that said, you can tell straight away what kind of um, effects is gonna have so at the 48 second mark for 16 seconds your life is decreased by 20 every second and of course you get that 100% boost in score all right so let's see whether this plate has a special note um, as we have seen in all the Wakure episode plates so far for the swimsuit collection there have no uh, there have not been a single episode plate that uh, has the special note attached to it so let's see where Ranka is the first one to break that um, combo um, sadly to say, Ranka continues on with that terrible streak of not having a special note attached to the episode plate. Uh, but who knows, maybe Cheryl might do something different with hers. Um, but hopefully Cheryl's episode plate might be slightly better than Ranka's. I don't know, but the, the stats on this episode plate is kind of um, 
the meaning I don't think I think Macross Frontier deserves equally as much love as Macross Delta I'm not too sure why this is happening um, might be an error who knows maybe maybe this is the total score that is um, that given to the episode played before the plus 25 lock is in play I don't know no. I, I really have no clue anyway guys it might be an error who knows maybe not but even so if if, if it wasn't an error my opinion is you might want to lay off spending too much on getting this episode played even though yes it is one of Ranka's most lovely Im uh, illustrated images so far uh, when it comes to a swimsuit because well she doesn't have a uh, swimsuit episode played as of yet since the two years of Uta Macross being around uh, unless you want to count the bikini that she wears for the costume of good job yeah, that is that is kind of like a swimsuit, uh, aside from all the, the mini jacket and the pants that she's wearing. Uh, underneath that is still a swimsuit. So <laughs> anyway, guys, let's do this. Uh, I I might pull more than I need to because I definitely want to get Ranka's costume unlocked straight away. So yeah, let's see how things goes. Um, with the first pull, the luck has been terrible for all the gacha videos recently so maybe it's time to turn things around with some uh, pretty awesome pools so one two three four five we do get five planes so there is a slightly higher chance that i might get a rainbow box oh, wow i get two rainbow boxes okay that is a real surprise all right let's skip some of the common stuff hopefully this evolves no it doesn't oh freya all right loving some china dress Alright, skipping more common stuff. Milene, please don't cry. It's, it's gonna be a good plate, right? Yeah, it is a Ranka plate, kind of, but it is an old one, so still pretty happy. Alright, skipping more common stuff. Uh -huh. Alright, lots of frontier love right there. Uh -huh. Freya feeling the love. <laughs> and here's this last rainbow box. And oof! we get two old plates out of the first template pool okay that, that's just horrendous <laughs> uh, oh so okay so this, I don't have this yet let's see which costume does this belong to oh it belongs to Cheryl okay not exactly a Ranka plate anymore but oh well <laughs> um, I'm still pretty happy that it is because it's a new plate um, but even though it's an old episode plate but that's fine I suppose um, Alright, let's try this again. There is no continue to pull button because the first gacha is discounted. So from here on, it's all 500 singing stones. Uh, I definitely want to have enough points to at least unlock uh, Ranka's uh, swimsuit. So here we go. Second round. I do, As you can tell, I've stored up quite a bit of singing stones waiting for this day. <laughs> Alright, some loading there but not long enough to probably um, promise us uh, Ranka's brand new episode plate, who knows. Alright, three planes, so pretty decent luck, I suppose. <clears throat> no red boxes on the first blink, that's horrendous. Oof, this is terrible. Okay, let's skip for the common stuff and go right to the red box because that's what we want to see. Hopefully it evolves. Um... Oh. Come on. Where are you? Leaving the best for the last, I suppose. Here we go. Does it evolve? No! Oh, we do get a brand new um, episode plate that belongs to this gacha. So, uh, exclusive episode plate. There we go. And... Well, I do have the notification for Ranka swimsuit um, popping up already. So, just to make sure, yes, this episode plate gives you Ranka's costume points. Alright, so we're gonna test a theory out at the same time. Um... Uh, because, well, um, we have, or rather I have been notified that, you know, uh, one of our watchers, uh, viewers, <laughs> uh, yeah, has been trying out different variations of maybe improving their luck in terms of pulling gachas and all that kind of stuff. So we're going to try one of the theories that I think that is plausible um, because, um, well, I out of all the theories that um, this person has given 
uh, or shared to me. Um, I've already tested most of them except for this one. So I'm changing my diva on the main screen to Ranka to improve the luck because the gacha belongs to Ranka. So let's see whether having Ranka on the main screen will actually improve your luck um, in, in terms of pulling out um, the um, how do you say the, the main plate for the gacha itself and let's see whether this really can change things around um, for, for the most of us. Alright, so let's do this. The third, pl uh, third pool of 10 plates. Alright, here we go. Oh, one plane. That's horrendous. Okay. Oh, we get three boxes on the second bling. First one, no, no evolution of the plate. That's kind of a bummer. That's what we were hoping to see because we have Ranka on the main screen. Oh, wow. All the red boxes in the front. Okay, we do get to evolve this one. Um, so yeah, that's not too bad. Skipping all the common stuff as usual. Oh, I skipped the red one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Anyways, okay, so none of the red boxes actually evolved. That's kind of a sad thing. Um, I mean, it yeah, evolved to a 5 star instead and they all retained to become a 4 star version. But, you know, it's, it's pretty nice to see that I actually got one of the exclusive plates fully evolved. Um, which is pretty nice. Um, yeah, yeah, so let's try this again. Hopefully with the 4th round... Uh, things might mm, get better because definitely we don't have enough um, episode plates to grant us that full costume unlock so that's kind of a kind of a bummer all right so let's do this again it might be my last pool because i definitely want to retain some of the singing stones for the rest of the four divas that have yet to get their swimsuits and of course uh, i need them to create more video content for you guys as well to watch all right so let's do this might be the final pool all right here we go okay there's a bit of loading there so hopefully hopefully very hopefully um we might get something nice oh my goodness not a single plane okay that's horrendous what kind of luck is this <laughs> uh-huh first bling not too bad Alright, so here we go. Evolution, please. Oh, come on. Wait, I've not seen this plate before. So this is probably new. Okay, moving away from all the common stuff. Alright, here we go. No evolution again. Osma being shocked again once as, as always. Whenever he sees his little sister, adoptive little sister, um, well, been taking part in Miss Macross pageant. <laughs> there we go. I think it's the last red box. Uh, ooh, little, little, um, Elto. I almost said Kaito. Uh, the name's so similar. <laughs> it, oh, there's another red one. I, I kind of miscounted. I'm not paying attention fully <laughs> when doing this gacha. Okay. Here we go. Oop. Okay, so we get the little one and the grown-up one beside each other. That's a pretty nice illustration actually for Elto. Um, yeah, so I don't think I have enough points for Ranka. So I guess I have to do another one. Uh, do I have to? I guess so. Um, yeah, let's do another one. Anyway, um, we've done two template pools with Ranka on the front. Uh, and so far, it hasn't really done justice uh, to prove the theory. Um, guys, um, if you want to try this theory out yourself, um, having the diva of that particular gacha on your main screen to help you improve getting uh, uh, improve your chances of getting the main episode played out. Uh, let me know of your results uh, if you actually tried out this theory down below, how many pulls you've done, and of course, um, what are your... What are the, the pools that you got? I mean, like, how, how well did you do? Like, how many 
um, four star episode plates and five star p- episode plates that you got, even though if it's a hit or miss, um, you know, in terms of whether these plates belong to that uh, brand new lineup of gacha. Uh, if you're wondering what are the new plates that can be found in the gacha, you can check them out. I usually update on the um, Facebook page as well. Um, once uh, Dana has actually uploaded those information onto the Uta Macross official wiki um, in Japanese. So yeah, you can check them out all there. If not, you can check out the official Uta Macross wiki as well if you want to find out the information from there. And of course, yeah, um, thank you, um, Alison, for suggesting uh, theories in terms of what can be done to improve gacha pools. Sadly to say, even for this particular theory, it doesn't seem to be working for me even though I have tried it before in the past but just want to prove it again um, you know just to to test out and have fun at the same time so anyway guys I'm gonna do my very last pool for Ranka because I cannot afford to do more um, I still have to save up for Cheryl's Gacha which is probably gonna be one single pool I guess and of course oh my goodness this is horrendous why is it just not my day it is not my day even though it's my birthday okay god dang it <laughs> Ah, uh, this is not doing so good. Ranka is not coming up to wish me happy birthday. I guess, I guess that image counts as a happy birthday wish. <laughs> mm, even Max is confused. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, let's do this last final pool. I probably might have to use episode ops to unlock Ranka's swimsuit, but I think I have a feeling that I I don't have enough um, because I kind of used up quite a bit of it for. Some of the wild creation suits, so that's kind of a bummer. Alright, so that's it, I suppose. Or oh, could I afford to do another one? I think I can. Um, because 300 sing stones for the first 10 plate pool. Um, then, of course, if we're talking about four different divas left, um, it's just 1200 sing stones. Yeah, I can go for another one. Let's do like one last one. One last one, hopefully things go well. If not, oh god, this is just horrendous. Here we go guys. Very final pool. Uh, and one final plane to say goodbye to. My luck. <laughs> oh no, what is this horrendous luck? Oh god. This is terrible. Dana, what is going on? This is not a big red up gacha at all. Oh. Uh, There we go, the last one. No evolution at all. Okay, that's it guys. Alright, so that's it for the pool. Um, hopefully, you guys have way better luck than I did. And yeah, I got interrupted during the recording as you can tell the dogs closing behind me. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, hopefully as usual, you find all the information I shared useful. Let me know by hitting the like, bu like button down below. I'm, I'm fumbling right now because uh, I kind of need to rush to work right now after this recording on the video. Uh, yeah, and I can, only rec I can only edit this video when I return from work tonight. So by the time you watch this video, it's probably the end of the day. And yeah, guys, uh, if you guys want to wish me a happy birthday, let me know in the comments down below as well. <laughs> Uh, and I, I, I might be doing a live stream of a uh, gameplay on my Facebook page as well. Uh, I've already left a poll there for you guys to go and select. Maybe if you want to see a brand new game. Or maybe you want to see me con try and complete an old game that I've uploaded on my YouTube channel that I have not touched in a long time. Let me know, guys know in that poll on my Facebook page. Uh, links in the description down below once again. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys soon in the next Utah Macross video. Until then, bye!